And yeah, guys, all these filters and even more were in Zoom. Yes, this is the Zoom meeting, and I have all of these Snapchat filters. And if you want to get them as well, watch this video. Hey, what's up guys? This is again Showtime with MZ back with another video. And if you're new to this channel, we are making a bunch of cool technological tutorials and way, way more just like this. So definitely consider subscribing if you're new. And now in this video, we are gonna actually, or I'm gonna actually teach you guys how to get the Snapchat filters to Zoom because sometimes, of course, Zoom has all those cool filters in it, but sometimes those filters are just limiting, you know? You want some more freedom as you get in the Snapchat filters. So yeah, just jump to getting Snapchat filters to Zoom. Okay, so now I'm gonna quickly start the screen recording over here so that you can see what I'm doing. Um, there we go. So the screen recording has started. I think you are already seeing it. And yeah. Uh, so the first thing you want to go do is that you're going to go to the your browser. I don't know if it's Zoom, uh, Chrome or Safari. I'm going to go to the Chrome and search for Snap Camera. Okay. You might also search for Snap Camera Download, but in each and every single case, you're gonna get this thing. And if you could not follow the instructions, the link to this thing is down below in the description. Okay, so now what you are seeing over here is the screen. So it tells you introducing the snap camera, bring the magic of lenses to your live streams and video chats on PC and Mac. So in this case, I'm using the MacBook, as you can see. So we are gonna just simply tap the download button over there and don't expect that it will really start downloading it by it itself. Like you wanted to do some little stuff. So you're gonna get to this page and what you're gonna do is that you're gonna scroll all the way down and check this box over here, which says, I have read the privacy policy and agree to it. Then you wanna actually uh, insert your email in this field so i'm going to just simply insert my email and then you want to um, confirm that you are not a robot okay let me just quickly insert my email over here okay there we go and now you're going to go scroll the way all the way down of course check you are not a robot and tap the download for mac or if you're using a pc tap download for pc I'm using the Mac, so we're gonna just simply tap download for Mac, and there you go. In this corner, you can see that something has started downloading. So yeah, this is basically the Snap Camera Package Installer, or something, whatever you call it. And it doesn't really take up a lot of time to actually install, download, whatever you call it, this program. It takes just a few seconds, not even a minute. Like, while I was already talking to you, it has almost already downloaded so like um five seconds left so five four three two one and there we go so yeah snap camera has already been downloaded now we're gonna double tap it to open or we're gonna tap the arrow to open it i'm gonna just simply double tap it you know i just prefer this way so then you will be like, then we will get this window which says install snap camera. Welcome to the snap camera installer. You will be guided through the steps necessary to install the software. So we are gonna just simply tap the continue button over there. Then select the disk where you want to install the snap camera. You're gonna just simply select the disk. If you have two users, you are gonna select the user, I think. And then you're gonna tap the continue button over there, tap install and the it will ask you the passcode for your Mac and user for your Mac, which you are installing it on. So yeah, just insert all of that and you will see the snap camera as an um, application itself. And of course you wanna allow the uh, FaceTime camera access so that like it can access your camera, I know. A uh, snap camera would like to access the microphone, okay. And there we go, we get the installation was successful thing. We can keep or move to trash the installer package. I'm gonna just simply keep, I don't know why it's just a strange habit, don't ask me please. 
so um and there we go so we have the snap camera welcome to snap camera where snapchat lenses when you stream record or video chat so we're gonna just simply tap the next button over there then using snap camera is easy we know that one close any active window or video or streaming apps so if you have opened the zoom as I have right now, like if you see that dot, black dot under the Zoom application, you want to just simply um, right click it and then you are going to just simply tap the quit button or force quit if you have that option. So, and to reopen the app and select snap camera in settings. So, we're going to just simply tap the finish button over there just like this and the, there we go we have multiple lenses over here you can of course select the camera that you want to use in settings just this one in this case facetime hd and there we go as you can see i'm uh, looking like a baby because it's like a snapchat filter you know what i'm saying and you can get this filter on zoom which is of course awesome now let's actually get it on zoom because i'm talking a lot and of course you can like choose uh, whichever i don't know like whichever filter you want to use um, that's not my best angle definitely but like you can choose the anime style that i have uh, chosen uh yeah so go liver just remind me later and there we go so we can get the anime style which looks just like this as you are seeing on my computer as well as you can choose like the baby one that I had um, a couple seconds ago. I don't know. But now let us actually get these filters to the zoom. So yeah, just don't waste time and get them to zoom. Okay. So if you want, you can just close this window of the snap camera and then just close everything if you want, like I want. And now go to Zoom, okay? Now you wanna of course sign in if you are not already. Okay, and once signed in, you wanna just simply tap the join meeting and you wanna join the meeting or just start a new meeting, you know, if you're a host or something. And there we go, we get the worst angle possible, great. And now join with the computer audio, you know that stuff, don't you? And now what we are gonna do is that we're gonna actually go to the video, like where it says stop video thing over there. And we're gonna tap that little arrow icon. So we're gonna just simply tap it and then you will have select camera. You can also access this menu by shift, command, and which we're gonna do right now, shift, command. And there we go and what's going on okay okay I understand so you can just simply change to the next camera you have like the next camera option you have but in this case what we're gonna do is that we're gonna actually tap again this arrow button then we are gonna choose like you might have only two options in here I don't know uh, you might have only FaceTime HD camera, which is this one, which is the built-in one in your computer and the snap camera one. So you might not have this at the cam and you're in webcam. So just simply choose the snap camera option over here and there you go. You will have this uh, yellow screen at first. And if your internet connection is, you know, stable, I'm gonna just simply jump to the place where I have like a good internet connection and let's see how this works. And there you go, you get this filter, which doesn't look that great on me, but yeah, you get this baby filter, hello. You also can get like other filters just by going to the snap camera and choosing like whichever you want. You see like you can actually get it next to it and you can just simply choose whatever you want and you'll get that one just you will get the yellow screen over there sometimes you don't even get and yeah like you see it like that's how it works you can get like even cooler filters you can search for filters actually which are just like this you know and uh for example lasers there you go ha <laughs> ha ha Okay, and you can see the preview of what you are seeing, well, what you will be seeing like over here. You can get another lasers just like this, or these ones just like this. 
or just other cool stuff uh, such as for example i don't even know which one you can also get the backgrounds sometimes so for example room okay just simple room nothing good uh too much but there you go you get it don't you so yeah uh not really that accurate i'd say but still like uh, just snapchat filter it doesn't need to be that accurate but it works great as you can see you can believe me or not but um i think the baby filter looks great the best actually so you can like uh, search for them choose them and yeah that's basically your tutorial on not that one uh, that's basically your tutorial on how to get the snapchat filters to zoom meetings you can do it like in every single zoom meeting whether you are the host or not whether even whether you have like that limitations you know some schools get those um, administrative limitations uh, to their students so that like if uh, they created their account on zoom then they cannot use some backgrounds or filters but what are you even talking about when you have the snapchat filters into the zoom so yeah that's basically your tutorial on how to get the snapchat filters on zoom hope you enjoyed this video if you did then smash that like button down below and of course subscribe as well down below so that you don't miss just any future videos that you might really need just like this one and i'll see you guys later bye